he knows the payment. When he is offering, he knows the payment. That's why you will see the scripture where it says, for we do not have a high priest that cannot empathize with. He knows exactly what the payment he paid for. He knows exactly what the payment he had to pay for the sin. So he brings that payment to this table. And God gladly receives it. And when he received it, what is he saying? He's no longer looking at Jesus. He's no longer looking at Jesus. He is looking at you and he says you are righteous the same way that Jesus is I might now if I say this statement you might think I am being proud but no listen to me the same way he sees Jesus is what he is seeing you as he is also the advocate and he is the one who made the payment now he is standing there with his briefcase full of blood Look, I paid for him. I paid for her. And now Jesus, God looks at it and says, Okay, I declare you righteous. Amen. I declare you righteous. He did, he's no longer looking at your works, y'all. He's no longer looking at how dark your past was, how worse of a person you were, what kind of a bad things you have done. He's not looking at none of those things because he already knows you're a bad person. We all know we are a sinner. We already know that. He no longer has to look at it. But his plan is for you to get off that bench. And bring you to the right side. That is where he, he takes the sin as far as the east is from the west. Because he's no longer looking at you from that sinful person. That is one of the reasons you and me, we need to adapt and adopt to this ideology that I am not a sinner saved by grace, but I am the righteousness of God. Yes, Amen. Amen. Amen.